Hi guys, welcome to Pilates with Hena and today we will do a best workout for weight loss. This workout is designed to work multiple muscles at once which will maximize your weight loss. Today we are going to target all the major muscles on your body including your arms, your core and your quads. So when you're ready, just draw your mat and let's begin. Alright, so let's start by going to on for position. Open your arms shoulder apart and your legs here with apart. So put your shoulder far away and look down to the mat. I want you to tuck your feet. Now inhale, lift your knees up and exhale, bring it down. And 10 times here with your own breath. Inhale deeply and exhale, bring it down. So belly button in, engage your core. And I don't want you to arch your back here. So keep your back in neutral. And inhale, exhale. Inhale, lift. And exhale down. Remember to breathe because it's gonna help to engage your core so much more. And keep breathing here. So five and down. Lift and down. Bring it down slowly with control and use your breath to control the movement. So last one. Slowly come back and come to try pose. Shake your hips a little bit. Now inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. When you're ready, I want you to allow yourself to lie down on your lower back. Very good. Now, keep your back in neutral arms along your body. Bring your legs up to 90 degrees and keep your feet activated here. So belly button in. I want you to inhale, lift your head and your shoulder off the mat and arms along your body start to pump in your hands. Inhale five times. And exhale five times. Lift your chest a little bit higher and exhale. Now I want you to do, it too, to do it with your own breath here. So keep breathing, belly button in and stick your lower back down to the butt. Activate your feet, keep your hips square and your lower leg parallel to the floor here. So keep breathing, chest up a little bit higher and chin the chest to protect your neck. Now if you feel tired on your neck here, I want you to use your hand to support your head. Now open your elbows a little bit wider here, shoulder down towards your hip and to the other side. Keep breathing and use your whole arm to pumping, not just your wrist like this. So keep breathing, belly button in and five. If you want more challenge, always can lengthen your leg to 45 degree here and stick your lower back down to the mat. Very good. And three. Exhale. And inhale through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. Inhale. And exhale. Squeeze in the thighs. Contract your pelvic floor muscle here. And one more breath. And exhale. And bring your head and shoulder down. Hug your knee to your chest. Inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. Feel your body already warm up. Very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale and arms along your body. Bring your leg up to 90 degrees. Stick your heels and your knees together. Activate your feet. Now make sure that you keep your back neutral here. Don't arch your back. Now inhale, bring one leg down and come back to the other side. And make sure that you always keep the same angle on your knee here. So keep breathing. Every movement start from your hips. Now we try to do it eight more times each side. With your own breath, keep breathing six, seven. To your left, come back slowly with your breath and control. And five. To the other side. Three. To your right, come back to your left. And two more times each side with your own breath, belly button in and keep breathing. Last one, slowly inhale down and exhale, bring it back. Now stick your heels and your knees together, activate your feet here. I want you to challenge yourself more by bring both legs down to the mat and come back. So you don't have to bring your leg too low as long as you can keep your back in neutral here or press your lower back down to the mat, belly button in, keep breathing. Inhale, bring it down and exhale through your mouth, bring it all the way up. So inhale deeply, keep the same angle on your knee here, activate your feet and really feel your lower abs working here. So squeeze in the thighs, couple more times with your own breath, keep breathing, inhale down and exhale up. And five, keep breathing, 
four, and three more times with your own breath, two, very good, and last one, bring those down and bring them back again. Now open your legs wider and come back. So squeeze in the thighs when you do that. Put your hips square. So engage your core. Inhale, open. And exhale, bring it back together. And five, four, three. Keep breathing. And two more times with your own breath. Feel your core is in. And your belly button towards your spine. So contract your pelvic floor muscle here. Last one, open and slowly come back. Now from here, I want you to inhale, open your arms to 45 degree, bring your legs to one side and come back, exhale to the center, inhale to the other side and exhale to the center. Make sure that you don't lift your opposite shoulder up to the mat. So keep breathing, inhale and exhale, bring it back and eight more times with your own breath. Belly button in, keep breathing, resting. Very good. Now lengthen your neck and look up to the ceiling. Contract your pelvic floor muscle here. Activate your feet. Beautiful. And five. To the other side. Try to bring your legs a little bit lower to work your obliques more. And keep breathing. Three. Engage your core slightly here to make sure your lower back is supported. And two more times each side with your own breath. Last one to your right and last one to your left. And bring it back to the center. Bring your legs down. Now inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale, bring your arms all the way up to the ceiling. Now keep your palms facing each other, press your feet down, inhale deeply, chin to chest, and lift your shoulder up, reach your hand forward, your heels, and come back, reach, and bring it back, so you don't have to bring your head all the way down to the mat, just a little bit movement here, and exhale, try to reach all the way up, <sighs> inhale down, and exhale, reach, and bring it back, press your feet down to the mat, and keep your legs parallel here, chin to chest, to protect your neck, so contract your pelvic floor muscle here. And three, two, feel your core. And last one, reach. And slowly bring it down. Shoulder down, head down. Inhale deeply through your nose, stretch your hips a little bit. And exhale deeply through your mouth. Very good. Now from here, still keep your arms along your body. Open your leg, hip width apart. Keep your feet flat. Now inhale, I want you to draw your hips all the way up. So your shoulder down to the mat, belly button in, lift your heels up and bring it down. So a couple more times, see with your own breath, squeezing your thighs, belly button in. Very good. And keep breathing. Now tuck the tailbone forward, squeezing the thighs, chin to chest, belly button in. And 10, 9, 8, breathe naturally here. 6, 5, Four, three, two, and one. Slowly draw your hips down. Each vertebra at a time. Very good. Now from here, lift your head and your shoulder off the mat. Hug your knee to your chest and lengthen your leg to 45 degrees. So I want you to inhale deeply. Lift your chest higher and exhale, switch. And a couple more times with your own breath here. Reach and chin your chest. Keep breathing. Use your hand to pull your knee toward your chest a little bit more. And eight more times each side. So keep breathing. Seven. The lower your leg is, the more challenge your lower abs has. So keep breathing. Beautiful. And four. To the other side. Three. To the other side. Two. And keep breathing. Last one. Lengthen and lengthen to the other side, head and shoulders down. So hug your knee to your chest, inhale deeply through your nose, and you can rotate your ankle here if you need to. Now from here, I want you to inhale and again, 
put one leg down to the mat and lengthen one leg all the way up to the ceiling. So activate your foot and dorsiflex your arms along your body. Now bring your leg down and lift it up. Bring it down, belly button in, lift it up. And press your foot down to the mat. Keep breathing here. So eight more times with your own breath here. Contract your pelvic floor muscle and bring it up and down with control. So squeeze your thighs. Inhale deeply and exhale deeply. Beautiful. And six. Keep breathing. Five. Four. Three. Beautiful. Now make sure that you keep your hips stabilized and balanced. Only your leg is moving. And come back. Bend your knee to the other side. Dorsi flex and bring it down. And lift. So make sure you don't move your hips here. Stabilize it. And squeeze in your thighs with your own breath. Feel your legs connecting to each other. So your opposite leg, press your foot down and knees still facing up to the ceiling. Arms down to the mat. And shoulders down. Very good. So six more times with your own breath. Keep breathing. Inhale down. And exhale back. Belly button in. And five. Four. Dorsiflex with your foot. Activate it. Two, and last one. Inhale down, exhale up, and bend your knee, and bring your leg down. So keep your heels up and down a little bit here. Now I want you to inhale and bring your arms all the way up to the ceiling. Now this time, chin your chest, press your feet down, and keep one foot distant from your heel to your butt. So open your leg here with apart here, chin your chest, draw your hips all the way up. Now this time, I want you to inhale and slowly lift your heels up. And when you bring your heels down, bring your arms down as well. And lift your heels up and bring it down. So slowly with your own breath, but keep breathing. Chin your chest, look toward your knees here. And we try to do it eight more times here with your own breath. Belly button in, seven. Keep breathing, six. Lift and down and five. And bring it down, four. Keep breathing, three, two. And last one, lift and slowly bring it down and draw your hips down each vertebra at a time. Shake your hips from left to right. Now this time, lift your head and your shoulder off the mat. Now use your hand to support your head. Open your elbows wider and press your hips down towards your hips here. So inhale, bring one leg up to 90 degree, activate your foot and slowly exhale, reach your knee towards your head and come back. So lift your head and your chest a little bit higher and bring it back. Again, always make sure you open your elbows so you can work your core more. And keep breathing here. So eight more times with your own breath. Exhale up and inhale down. Belly button in, keep breathing. Six, five, stick your lower back down to the mat. Four, keep breathing, activate your foot here. Press your opposite foot down to the mat. and. Two more times, last one, slowly bring it down to the other side and exhale, reach, inhale, bring it down, exhale, reach, and come back, reach, so squeeze your thigh, try to bring your knee toward your head a little bit more and open your elbows wider, shoulders down toward your hips, very good, so keep breathing, and three, two, and last one, lift, and slowly bring your leg down, head and shoulders down. Shake your hips from left to right. Inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. All right. Now from here, I want you to inhale and allow yourself to lift your head and shoulder up again. Now this time, arms along your body again. Now inhale, lengthen one leg to 45 degree. Squeeze your thighs and exhale, reach and bring it back. So reach and bring it back. So you can move your leg just a little bit. Move your chest high, go here and belly button in. Keep breathing. I, you can always bring your leg a little bit higher for more challenging like this and come back. So keep breathing. We try to do it six more times with your own breath. And exhale, inhale down, exhale up and inhale down. Change the chest to protect your neck and reach your hand further, far away from your shoulders. Beautiful. And two more times here. And last one, reach and slowly 
bring your head down, shoulders down to the other side. Again, inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. And when you're ready, lift your head and your shoulder up again, chin to chest, chest a little bit higher here to protect your neck. Now arms along your body again and lengthen one leg to 45 degree inhale and exhale, reach, come back, move your leg just a little bit to feel your lower abs and core here. And again, couple more times if you want more challenge, try to lift your leg all the way up to the ceiling and come back. So reach your hand a little bit further and keep breathing. Six. Six. So every time you reach up, two, and last one. Slowly bring your leg down, bend your knee, hug your knee to your chest, inhale deeply through your nose, and exhale deeply through your mouth. All right, very good. Now I want you to inhale and bring your legs up to 90 degree again, dorsiflex. flex. So arms along your body. Now this time lengthen one leg and come back to the other side. We try to do it 10 times each side with your own breath here. Belly button in, squeezing the thighs and stabilize your hips. Keep it balanced. Come back, lengthen lesson one, pulling your leg away from your hips and keep breathing. Activate your feet, arms down to the mat and press your shoulders down very good so keep breathing inhale exhale come back inhale lengthen exhale bring it back keep your legs parallel to the floor and parallel to each other so try not to fluctuate your hips here only your legs are moving stabilize your hips and your torso so keep breathing lengthen your neck look up to the ceiling six more times each side with your own breath so inhale lengthen exhale come back very good and four more times here inhale exhale inhale three exhale come back and to the other side and two more times with your own breath, keep breathing, don't hold your breath. And last one to your left, come back. So hug your knee to your chest, shrug your hips, chin to chest, inhale deeply through your nose, and exhale deeply through your mouth. Now rotate your ankle and reverse. Now from here, bring your legs all the way up to the ceiling again. Now arms along your body. This time, I want you to inhale, bring one leg down, and then move one knee toward your chest and switch to the other side. So we try to speed it up just a little bit here and use your breath to control the movement in your core. Keep the same angle on your knee and try to move as much as you can and do the maximize, maximize your range of motion here. So keep breathing, belly button in. And eight more times with your own breath. In your core, inhale and exhale a little bit further your leg and your knee towards your head a little bit more. Keep breathing in your core. And squeeze your thighs, really feel your leg working here. Contract your pelvic floor muscle. And if you can, squeeze your butt together. Beautiful belly button in. And five, four, three, two, and last one to the other side. And bring it back, hug your knee to your chest. Inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. Now from here, I want you to lift your head and your shoulder off the mat again. And hands support your head. So open your elbows wider here. Now pull your belly button in and slowly activate your feet. Keep it to 90 degree again. Now this time, inhale, lift your chest higher. Lengthen one leg to 45 degree. And lengthen the other leg to 45 degree. Now bring one leg up and on it, leg down. And down to the other side, come back and keep breathing. Lengthen your neck here, stick your low back down to the mat. Very good. Open your elbows wider, shoulder toward your hips, and couple more times with your own breath here. So, five to the other side, keep breathing, and four, three, belly button in, two. Beautiful guys, keep it up. And last one, lengthen to the other side, bring it back and hug the knee to your chest. 
Inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth again. All right. Now, I want you to bring your legs up to 90 degree again. Dorsi flex with your feet. So arms along your body. Now this time, open your leg to the side and then move it back. Keep the same angle on your knee and come back like we draw a half of a circle around your hips. So a couple more times with your own breath here. And we try to do it five more times. Four, open and come back. Three, inhale halfway and exhale halfway. Two, stick your low back down and keep your back in neutral. And last one, beautiful. And we reverse. So down first and to the side with your same leg on the same side. Beautiful. Keep breathing. And four more times with your own breath. Inhale halfway, exhale, come back. Inhale down and to the side, exhale, bring it all the way up. Very good. And two, last one. Beautiful. To the other side, leg to the side and draw half of the circle. Come back. Couple more times with your own breath here. Beautiful. Four more times. Activate your feet, engage your core as much as possible. Three, two, and last one. Press your arms down, belly button in, stabilize your hips here. Now reverse, bring your leg down to the side, come back, leg down to the side and bring it back. And five more times with your own breath, keep breathing. Four, three, and two more times with your own breath. Last one, down to the side and come back. Bring both legs down to the mat. Shake your hips, inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Open your leg hip with the part here. Keep your feet flat, arms along your body. Now inhale and draw your hips all the way up as high as you can and exhale, bring it down. Really feel your booty muscle work here. So a couple more times with your own breath. Chin to chest, belly button in. And inhale, lift each vertebra at a time. Exhale, bring it down. Tuck the tailbone forward, chin to chest, up. And exhale, all the way down to the mat. So eight more times here, lift and slowly bring it down. All the way up. Seven, keep breathing. And six. Squeeze your nose high, squeeze your butt together. Five, as high as you can. And four, inhale. And exhale through your mouth. Keep your hips balanced and stabilized here. So lift. Beautiful. And come back. And three. Two. All the way up. And bring it down. Last one. Inhale all the way to the ceiling and come back each vertebra at a time. Shake your hips from left to right. Now, a little bit more challenging here. So bend your knees up to 90 degree. Inhale, lift your hips up. Keep your hips balanced and bring it back. Inhale, lift and exhale down. Press your whole arms and shoulders down to the mat. So keep breathing, activate your foot and make sure that you press your opposite foot down. So keep your hips balanced. Don't shift your hips to one side. Make sure that is make a line parallel to the floor here. Beautiful. Now from here, lengthen your leg. Inhale, lift and bring it back. Inhale all the way up and bring it down on the same side of your hips here. So keep breathing a couple more times with your own breath and lift. If you feel that it's too hard for you, you always can bend your knees down, come back to the previous position and movement. Beautiful. Keep breathing and two more times. Inhale, lift and exhale down. Lift your hips as high as you can, but make sure you pull your belly button in to support your lower back. Now bend your knee down to the other side, 90 degree. Activate your foot here. Press your opposite foot down. Inhale, lift and exhale down. Keep breathing. Engage your core as much as possible. Really work your legs, your hips and your middle part of your body here. 
So belly button in, keep breathing, inhale up and exhale down. And three, press your arms down, shoulder down and far away from your ears. And last one, lift and slowly bring it down. Now lengthen your leg all the way up to the ceiling and we do the same movement. Draw your hips all the way up and exhale down. So stabilize your hips here, press your foot down to the mat, only your hips are moving up and down. And keep breathing. So we do it four more times here. Inhale, lift and exhale down. Squeeze in your thigh, feel your butt is working here. Two. And last one, inhale all the way up. Exhale, bring it down and hug your knee to your chest here. Shake your hips, inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Now hug one knee to your chest, lengthen one leg down to the mat, activate your feet. Inhale, lift your leg up and exhale, bring it down. Inhale, lift and exhale down. So belly button in, make sure you stick both hips down to the mat. So press your hips down, only your leg is moving. Press your arms and your shoulder down. So belly button in here, lengthen all the way up, exhale down and all the way up and exhale, bring it down. And five, four, three, two, and last one. Inhale, lift, exhale down and bend your knee to the other side, lengthen, inhale all the way up and exhale, bring it down. Try to lengthen your leg all the way up to the ceiling like someone pulling your leg away and come back again. Stick your hips down to the mat and keep it balanced. So belly button in. And five, four, bring it up and down with control. Three, two, and last one. Inhale up, exhale down and bend your knee. So inhale deeply through your nose and exhale. Now I want you to lift your head and your shoulder off the mat. So hug your hand with your knees here. Inhale and exhale. Bring your arms up and lengthen your legs to 45 degrees and come back. Belly button in. Lift your arms up and bring it back. A couple more times here. Stick your lower abs down to the mat. The lower your legs are, the more challenging your core is. So keep breathing. And a couple more times with your own breath. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, come back, arms up, and exhale, bring it back, belly button in, and five, chest up a little bit higher, chin to chest, look toward the front, I don't want you to point your chin up to the ceiling because it's going to cause a lot of pressure on your neck. So now challenge yourself, blow your legs a little bit more, inhale, lift, and exhale down, press your lower back down to the mat, and don't add your back here. So keep breathing, three, Two, last one, lengthen up and exhale, bring your head and your shoulder down, inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Now the next movement, I want you to inhale and head and shoulder off the mat again. So belly button in here, now hands support your head, open your elbows wider here and bend your knees 90 degree dorsiflex. flex, so I want you to push both legs to the front and come back belly button in lengthen and bring it back and a couple more times there with your own breath lengthen like someone pulling your leg away from the center beautiful 10 more times lengthen come back and challenge yourself so don't give it up keep it and back so lengthen like someone pulling your leg away from your hips keep breathing inhale exhale back belly button in and stick your lower back down to the mat here inhale deeply lengthen and exhale bring it back and four keep breathing three two and last one lengthen slowly come back and head and shoulder down hug your knee to your chest inhale and exhale all right very good now the next movement here i want you to bring your legs all the way up to the uh, 90 degree and activate your feet and heels and knees together so open your arms to 45 degree here now open your knees wider and move your heels towards your hips and lengthen your leg to 45 degree come back so your knees facing to the outside squeezing the thighs here couple more times with your own breath keep breathing 
Now, if you want more challenge, pressure, lower your leg a little bit more and keep breathing, but make sure that you don't arch your back here. So I want you to inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, bend your knees. Inhale, lengthen, all the way back. Very good. So inhale three more times with your own breath here. Two. And last one, lengthen, slowly bring it back. Close your knees, bring your legs down. Now inhale, shake your hips. Now from here, lean on one side to do psychic theory. Now put your hand in front of your chest and press your shoulder down far away from your ears. So activate your feet, bring it to the top of the mat here, belly button in. Now inhale, lift your leg just above your hips here, dorsi flex, and start to make a little pulse with your leg. So shoulder down towards your hips. And 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, two and one now point your toe to the front and slowly rotate your leg around your hips here so 10 times with your own breath keep breathing eight seven six five four three two and one dorsi flex and lift and down lift it up and bring it just above your hip down so keep breathing and eight more times with your own breath so lift and slowly down, lift and down. Beautiful, squeezing the thighs and feel your legs connecting to each other. So press your lower leg down to the mat and belly button in, keep breathing. So three, two, and last one, lift and slowly bring it down and bring your leg to the front. So bring it down and up. So keep your legs in front of your body here and keep breathing, dorsi flex with your foot so press your bottom leg down to the mat, belly button in. And five, four, three, two, and last one. Slowly bend your knees to 90 degree here. Lift your heels up, open your knees wider, and slowly squeeze it back together. 10 times with your own breath here. Contract your pelvic floor muscle. Inhale deeply, open, exhale, come up. Inhale, open, and exhale, bring it back couple more times with your own breath inhale lift exhale down lift and down and three two and one slowly bring your heels down shake your hips from that to right now come to the side lift here so shoulder on top of your elbow and i want you to lengthen your legs one foot in front of the other one belly button in so hand behind your head now i want you to inhale lift your hips as high as you can and bring it down 10 times with your own breath, press your forearm down to the mat. It keep breathing, open your elbows wider and lift your hips as high as you can. Feel your oblique here and belly button in. Very good. Keep breathing. And five, four, three, two, and last one. Now I want you to challenge yourself a little bit here. So lift your hips up and hold it here for five, four, three, two, and one. Bring your hips down. So one more time, but this time, add a little bit movement with your arm. So inhale, lengthen your arm up. Exhale, bring it down and lift and bring it down eight more times with your own breath here. Engage your core as much as possible. Six, five, four, three, two, and draw your hips down beautiful so the last movement on the side lift series so lift your hips up and bring your hand behind your head still so now i want you to inhale and exhale twist your torso to the front and come back close your elbows to the back and come back so a couple more times with your own breath six belly button in five four keep breathing three and two more times last one very good. Now hips down. Hug your knee to your chest and inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. And inhale one more time and exhale. Now allow yourself to lie down on the other side to do circuit theory on the other side. Now lengthen your legs to the front and keep your hips stabilized. So belly button in, hand in front of your chest and put your shoulder down. 
far away from your ears. I want you to lift your legs just above your hips here and dorsiflex. So start to make a little pulse with your top leg here. And keep breathing, belly button in. Beautiful. And five, four, three, two, and one. Now point your toes to the front and start to rotate your leg around your hips here. Keep breathing, inhale naturally and exhale through your mouth. Very good. Belly button in. And five, four, three, two, and slowly dorsiflex. I want you to lift your leg up and bring it down 10 times. And bring it down just above your hips. Inhale up and exhale down. Squeeze in the thigh. Dorsiflex with your feet here. So keep breathing. Press your lower leg down to the mat. And keep breathing. Beautiful. So six more times with your own breath. Squeeze in the thighs. Contract your pelvic floor muscle. And belly button in. In three, two, and last one. Slowly come back here. So from here, bring your leg to the front and bring your leg down and lift and bring it down. Make sure that you keep your foot dorsiflex here and stabilize your hip. So don't move your hips to the front or to the back. Just keep it hip on hip and press your hand down to stay balanced here. Lift your leg up and down. Feel the side of your hips and your butt is working. So keep breathing, belly button in. Inhale, lift and exhale down. Lift and down and five, four, three, two, and last one, lift and slowly bring it down. Bend your knees to 90 degree here. Beautiful, shake your hips a little bit. Now bring your heels up, inhale, lift your knees up and exhale, bring it down. Inhale, lift and exhale down. And eight more times with your own breath, squeeze in the thighs, belly button in and contract your pelvic floor muscle here if you can. So activate your feet, keep breathing, and five, four, try to open your knee as wide as you can. Three, two, and last one, lift, and slowly bring it down, heels down, shut your hips from left to right. Now, I want you to bring your forearm down to the mat, so your shoulder is on top of your elbows here, belly button in, and I want you to lengthen your leg and one foot in front of the other one. So make sure that you lift your waist up, hand behind your head, in your core as much as possible, and lift as high as you can, bring it down. 10 times with your own breath. Inhale, lift, and exhale down. Inhale all the way up, exhale down. Couple more times with your own breath here. Inhale, and exhale. Keep breathing, in your core, and press your shoulder down towards your hips. Beautiful. And five, belly button in, four, keep breathing, three, two, and last one, lift, and slowly bring it down. Very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale and bring your hips up, so stay here, and I want you to inhale, try to close your elbow to the front and come back. So we do it a couple more times with your own breath, make sure your shoulders down, in your core as much as possible, belly button in. Beautiful, press your feet down, engage your core, and five, four, three, two more times with your own breath, and last one, slowly open and bring your hips down, very good. Now from here, allow yourself a little bit challenge here, so I want you to lift your hips up and keep it here, inhale, Open your arm all the way up to the ceiling and come back 10 times with your own breath. Make sure your shoulder on top of your elbows and press your forearm down here. In your core, lift your hips as high as you can and lengthen your neck. Beautiful. And five, four, keep breathing. Three, two, feel your body is shaking. And last one, lengthen and slowly bring your hips down. Hug your knee to your chest. And inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. I really need it. Very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth and allow yourself to come to own four position here. 
Very good. Now open your arms, shoulder apart, and your legs hip width apart here. So in your core, keep your back in neutral, eyes and elbows rotate to facing each other. Now put your shoulder far away from your ears, so dip your shoulder between your arms and lift. In your core, don't arch your back here. So I want you to strengthen, straighten your arms here, only your shoulder move up and down between your arms. Keep breathing, and five, four, three, two, keep breathing, and last one, slowly come back. Now articulate your spine, put your shoulder down, inhale, look up, and exhale, Rise your spine, chin to chest, cat and core, each vertebra at a time, and we try to do it six more times with your own breath here, inhale, and exhale, Rise your spine, upper spine a little bit higher, and come back, and four, belly button in to support your lower back here. Contract your pelvic floor muscles, squeeze your thighs. Three more times with your own breath, each vertebra at a time, and feel the movement of your spine here. And two, and last one, articulate, look up, and slowly round your spine up and bring it back to neutral, beautiful. Now from here, I want you to inhale. Now stick your heels and your nose, uh, your knees together here. So try to bring one arm all the way up to the ceiling and bring it down to the other side and come back. Now try to lengthen your arms all the way up to the front like someone pulling your arm away and to the other side. You can soften your knee a little bit if you want, but I want you to lengthen to challenge yourself. So stabilize your torso here, only your arm and your Move it up and down. Keep breathing. Valley button in, in your core. And three. To your left. Two. Keep breathing. To the other side. And last one. Lengthen. Come back. Lengthen to the other side and bring it back. Now I want you to add a little bit movement with your leg. So inhale, bring your arm up and opposite leg up. Lengthen and activate your foot here and bring it down to the other side. Feel the balance here in your core as much as possible. Inhale, lengthen and exhale. Come back to the other side. I want you to lengthen your neck and look down to the mat. <sighs> to the other side and come back. And five, to your left, four, to your left. In your core and don't arch your back here. Keep breathing and use your breath to control the movement. Two. And last one, lengthen. Come back, lengthen. And bring it back. Come to try pose, inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth, beautiful. Now from here, I want you to inhale and move your forearm to the front of the mat here. So shoulder on top of your elbows, open your leg here with the part, tuck your feet. Now I want you to inhale and move your hips all the way up. And exhale, bring it down. So lengthen your neck, look to the middle of your fingers, but when you move your hips up, look toward your heels and come back in your core. Now we do it 10 times together. So inhale, lift, and exhale down. Inhale all the way up, and exhale, bring it down. And eight, belly button in, keep breathing here. Seven, six, five, Four, three, beautiful, and two more times with your own breath. Lift and slowly bring it down. Feel your shoulders here as well. And slowly come back, shake your hips from left to right. Now this time, I want you to inhale, lengthen one leg and move your hips down. So forearm plank here, shoulder on top of your elbow belly button in. Inhale and exhale, move up and down. So lift your hip up and exhale, hips down. Keep breathing with your own breath. In your core, tuck your feet here. And five, four, three, two, and last one. Inhale, lift and exhale down. And bend your knees, come to tripods. Inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. Very good. Now I want you to inhale and come to um, on for position again. So lengthen your neck here. Eyes and elbows rotate to facing each other. Put your shoulder far away and inhale deeply. Lengthen your leg to the back 
and lengthen the other leg to full plank here. So you always can make a fist if you think that it supports your wrist more. Or you can put your, fore, your arms, your palms down and pr open your um, fingers wide here, press it down to the mat, shoulder on top of your wrist, engage your core. Now I want you to inhale, tuck your feet, keep your heels and your knees together, inhale and bring your hips to your right, come back, belly button into your left and bring it back and we try to do it 10 times each side with your own breath, keep breathing and 9 to your left, belly button in, 8 to the other side, Keep breathing to your left. Six, belly button in always. Keep your shoulder far away from your ears. And four, in your core and make sure you don't bring your hips down lower to arch your back here. So we don't want to arch your back. Belly button in to support your spine. Beautiful. So three more times with your own breath. Keep breathing to your left. Inhale up and exhale back. Last time, to the other side, and back to the center, bend your knees down, come to tripos, rotate your ankle here, and reverse. Inhale deeply through your nose, and exhale deeply through your mouth. All right, now from here, I want you to inhale and slowly allow yourself to lie down on your stomach. So make a pillow under your forehead and press your shoulder down towards your hips here belly button in activate your feet inhale lift one leg up and exhale bring it down belly button in and stick your hips down to the mat make sure that you in your core so it will support your lower back here hips down only your leg up and down so activate your foot here keep breathing inhale and exhale down inhale lift and exhale down keep breathing and five more times each side with your own breath. Four to the other side. And three, lift and bring it down to your left. Two more times with your own breath here. Keep breathing. And to your right, come back. Last time to your left, bring it down. Shake your hips from left to right. Beautiful. Now from here, I want you to inhale and slowly bring one leg up and the other the other leg up here so activate your feet here dorsiflex inhale and start to open your legs wider and bring it back together inhale open and exhale bring it back a couple more times with your own breath here squeeze in the thighs you can track your pelvic floor muscle here and nine eight seven keep breathing rest your forehead on your hands and belly button in always toward your spine. Very good. Keep breathing, contract your pelvic floor muscles, squeeze your butt here. And we try to do it five more times with your own breath. Inhale, open, and exhale, come up. Inhale, open, and exhale, bring it back. And three, two, and last one. Slowly bring it back and bring your legs down, shake your hips from left to right. Very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale and rest your head on your mat and lift your hand up behind your head, support, open your elbows wider, lift your head up. Now I want you to inhale and exhale, bring it down, lift your legs up and come back, activate your feet. So still keep your legs open, hip width apart here. Belly button in, we try to do it 10 times together. Now head up and legs up, switch in your core and use your core to lead the movement, not the momentum here. Belly button in, keep breathing. Inhale, up, and exhale down. In your core as much as possible. Really feel your core is leading the movement here. So keep breathing. Belly button in, and come back. And three, two, last one. Slowly come back, and bring your arms, head down, shoulders down. Inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Shake your hips from left to right. And exhale one more time. Inhale and exhale. All right, very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale and bring your arms to 45 degrees. So now I want you to inhale and lift both legs and arm up, 
head still down and bring it back. Engage your core as much as possible. Belly button in, open your arms, your shoulder, and your chest all the way to the back. Beautiful. Inhale, open, and exhale, come back. You always can lift your head a little bit above the mat if you feel that like it's easier and more natural with you. So keep breathing, belly button in, lift, and exhale down. Inhale, lift, and exhale down. And five, four, three, keep breathing, two, and last one. Inhale, and exhale, bring it down. Bring your head down, shake it from that to right. Now this time, I want you to inhale and bend both knees up to the ceiling. So take your toes together and hand support your head here. So I want you to press your shoulder down towards your hips. Now inhale, lift your legs up and exhale, bring it down. And a couple more times with your own breath, make sure you don't, you don't raise your shoulder towards your ears when you lift your legs up. Because many people tend to do that, but we don't want to do that. So belly button in, keep breathing, inhale and exhale down. Squeezing the thighs, inhale, lift, and exhale down. And again, keep your shoulder down towards your hips. And belly button in, keep breathing, lift, and bring it down. Now from here, three more times, lift, and down, and two. And last one, slowly bring it down. Now I want you to press one leg down to the mat, and lift one leg higher. Come back to the other side, bring it back. So make sure that you still keep your head on, rest on your hand here. And lengthen your neck and lift your leg, your right and your left. So keep breathing, try to lift your leg as high as you can. Stick your opposite hips down when you lift your leg up. And keep breathing here and five to the other side, four to the other side and three. Squeeze your butt into your core as much as possible. Two. And last one, lift and slowly bring it down to the other side. Lengthen your leg, shake your hips from left to right. Beautiful. Now from here, put your hand neck to your chest and lengthen your neck. Close your elbows to the back. So inhale, open your legs, hip width apart and press your legs down, hips down. Inhale, lift your torso up. Inhale, lift your torso up and exhale, bring it down. Keep breathing and exhale down. Inhale all the way up and exhale down. And six more times with your own breath here. Keep breathing and lift and down. Belly button in, in your core. Always close your elbows to the back here. And three, two, very good. And last one, inhale and exhale, bring it down. Put your head down, shake your hips from left to right. Very good. Now I want you to do a little bit challenge here. So when you inhale, lift your head and your torso up and exhale down, bring both legs up. And again, legs down, torso up. So a couple more times, use your hand to push it up and down as well. Into your core as much as possible. And we try to do it five more times with your own breath. Keep breathing. Four, three, two, Last one, and slowly bring your torso down, shake your hips from left to right. Now, I want you to inhale, make, take a deep inhalation through your nose, and exhalation through your mouth. Now from here, move your hand next to your chest, close your elbows to the back. Now try to challenge yourself by touch your feet here, open your leg here with a part, lengthen your torso, your whole body, into your core, keep your back in neutral, and inhale, Push your torso up and exhale, bring it down. And now we try to inhale, do it five times with your own breath. So inhale, lift and exhale down. You always, if it's too hard for you, always can bend your elbows, bend your knees and lift it up. And exhale, bring it down. Otherwise, challenge yourself by lengthen both legs. So lift and down and four and three more times. Two and last one. Lift and hold it here for five, four, three, two, and one. Drop yourself down to the mat. Very good. So keep breathing. Inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Very good. Now open your arms to the side. Lengthen your arms here. Lengthen your neck and your leg. So I want you to inhale slowly. Bring both arms and legs up and exhale. Bring it down like we're flying 
on the land. Very good. So keep breathing. Inhale, lift and exhale down. Lengthen your neck. Inhale and exhale. Belly button in. Inhale your core as much as possible. So lift and down. And eight more times with your own breath. Keep breathing. Try to open your shoulders all the way to the back. Six. Keep breathing. Five. Inhale. Exhale down. Four. Three. And two more times with your own breath. Keep breathing. Last one. Bring your legs down. Shake your hips from left to right. Inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. Very good. Now I want you to inhale and bring your hand over your heart here. So lengthen your neck. Inhale and bring both arms and legs up. Make sure you slide back to open your shoulder far away from your ears. And we try to pump in your opposite hand and up like we do swimming again. But this time we try to do it 10 times. So inhale your core as much as possible. Nine, eight, seven, belly button in, six, five, four, three, and last one. Bring it down, rest your head on your hand, shake your hips from left to right, and when you're ready, allow yourself to come up back to tripod position. Open your knees wider, so shake your hips from left to right here. Inhale deeply, and exhale. Inhale up, reach your hand forward, and exhale slowly through your mouth. Very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale and come up to own front position again. So open your legs here with the part and your arms shoulder apart, eyes and elbows facing each other, and belly button in into your core. This time, inhale, tuck your feet and lift your knees up, lengthen your neck, look down to the mat and open your knees wider, come back and open and bring it back. So eight, squeeze in the thighs, try to bring your knee open as much as you can. Bring your knee, knees a little bit lower to keep your lower leg parallel to the floor. And four, three, two, and last one. Open, slowly come back, knees down. Shake your hips from left to right, beautiful. Now from here, I want you to inhale and still tuck the feet here. Lift your knees up and bring it down again. So 10 times with your own breath. Keep breathing, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and last one, lift and slowly bring it down. Now, stick your heels and your knees together. Bring one leg up to 90 degree. Inhale, start to make a little pulse with your leg. Make sure you don't arch your back here. Keep your back in neutral and belly button in. Try to reach as high as you can. Belly button in and stabilize your hips here. Now, lengthen your neck, look down to the mat. And five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it down to the other side. Lengthen, dorsiflex and start to make a little pulse again. So engage your core as much as possible. Inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. And five, four, three, two, and one. Slowly bring your legs down, shake your hips from left to right. Now from here, I want you to inhale and lengthen your leg. Keep your hips stabilized and balanced here. So tuck one foot, the, the leg that you bend your knee, tuck your foot. Now lift your knees up. Now from here, I want you to inhale and lengthen, keep your leg up and down, and bring your knee down. So inhale, lift, lengthen, and bring it down, knee down, and a couple more times with your own breath. So inhale deeply through your nose, engage your core, and feel your whole body is working here. Beautiful. And four, three, two, and last one, lift and slowly bring it down, bend your knee and allow yourself to do the other side here. So lengthen your opposite leg. Now again, tuck your foot, inhale, lift your knees up and lengthen, lift your leg up, bring it down, knee down. So knee up, opposite leg up and down. Very good. Couple more times with your own breath. Stabilize your hips, inhale deeply and exhale down. Very good. And we do it four more times with your own breath. Keep breathing. Three, two, 
and last one lift and slowly bring it down so come to try pose inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth shake your hips from left to right very good now from here I want you to inhale and slowly come back to on forward position again now stick your heels and your knees together so make a fist here with your own breath inhale and bend your elbows down inhale bring it down and exhale come back just a little bit movement here feel your shoulders and a couple more times with your own breath keep breathing you always can put your palms down and bend your knees until your forearm all the way down to the mat as well so engage your core as much as possible and make sure that you feel comfortable with your wrist here other way you can always make a fist to more for more support beautiful so three two and last one beautiful and lengthen your arms shake your hips from left to right now allow yourself to lean a uh, sit down in the middle of the mat here now i want you to lengthen your leg all the way to the front open your legs hip width apart here and dorsiflex flex with your feet so bring your arms to the front here inhale and shoulder down open your chest belly button in exhale reach forward inhale come back exhale reach forward and inhale bring it back belly button in keep breathing here and we try to do it eight more times with your own breath seven reach and back six five four three and two more times here last one reach and slowly bring it back shoulder down now from here open your arms to the side lengthen your arms here inhale and exhale move it all the way up and rotate the torso to one side come back to the other side make sure you press your feet and your whole leg down to the mat your sitting bone down so only your torso is rotating keep breathing and inhale deeply open your arms all the way to the side and come back to the other side keep breathing here lengthen your spine if you feel that it's hard to lengthen your spine here you always can use a pillow to sit on for support so keep breathing or soften your knees a little bit if you need to and belly button in very good and three more times with your own breath to the other side and two inhale down exhale up inhale and exhale last one and last one to the other side and bring it back to the center arms down rotate your shoulder from fully to four direction and reverse very good now from here i want you to keep your feet dorsiflex flex here and put your hand behind your hips so soften your elbows press your shoulder open your chest inhale lift and exhale down and belly button in couple more times with your own breath here chin to chest i want you to always look toward the front and lengthen your neck so don't pull your chin up to the ceiling because it's gonna have a lot of pressure on your neck so belly button in keep breathing inhale all the way up into your core exhale down and three soften your elbows if you need to make sure you never raise your shoulders up when you move your hips up try to lift your hips as high as you can and last one lift and slowly bring it down now keep your feet together and flex forward to stretch your hamstring inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth and one more time inhale and exhale deeply and roll up so cross your leg here open your arms to the side now shoulder down lengthen your spine slightly in your core inhale reach to your right a little bit and come back to the other side and bring it back a couple more times with your own breath inhale lengthen and exhale bring it back reach to the other side and come back and bring it back to the neutral now hand on opposite knee and rotate your torso to the back and to the other side and bring it back to the center shake your hips from left to right now inhale deeply i want you to roll your spine chin to chest and then articulate your spine inhale look up 
Exhale, right your spine, chin to chest, each vertebra at a time, get and curl on the sitting position here. And bring it back, belly button in, keep breathing. And come back. Very good. Now, bring your arms all the way back to the center again. Now, soften your elbows, inhale, and exhale, close your arms to the front, and open. And call your arms to the front. Make sure that you press your shoulder down towards your hips and a couple more times with your own breath. Close and open and close and inhale. Exhale, come back and all the way. Open your shoulders and your chest to the back and bring your arms down. Rotate your shoulder fully to four directions here and reverse. Now interlace your finger. I want you to reach up and reach to stretch your stomach a little bit here. And to the front, to the back. Now bend your elbows and slightly slide your hand towards your spine. Still keep your shoulder down. So close your elbows to the front and open, close and open. And one more time with your own breath and bring it back. Shake your hands, interlace your finger and rotate your wrist, reverse. Now bring your forearm parallel to the floor, reach and push your arms to your right. Hold it here for three, two, and one to your left. And hold it here for three, two, and one slowly. Come back to the center and now reach your hand one more time. Lean on one side, feel the side of your waist is stretching. And to the other side here. Belly button in slightly and come back one more time. Exhale back to the center. <sighs> Inhale to your left. And exhale back to the center and bring your hand down. Lengthen shoulder rotation and reverse. Now lengthen your spine. Inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. And that's a good up for today. Thank you so much for watching and enjoy the workout with me. So Please subscribe to see new workout every single day and let's stay healthy together. See you tomorrow. Bye.